Hello everyone, this is Riyad from Vigicom here. Today we are going to get S rank on the Eliminate the Dozer Faction mission in Chapter 2 of Armored Core 6. We will begin by taking a look at our loadout. So for this assembly we've got two Zippermans equipped to our arms and two Songbirds equipped to our backs. In terms of your frame parts and your internals, they'll matter a great deal. You just want to focus on damage output. So use whatever frame and internal parts you wish for this mission, as long as it lets you get from point A to point B very quickly, because speed is of the essence in this mission, as are ammo costs and repair costs. Small disclaimer, the footage was submitted not by myself, but by my friend and co-worker at VGKami, Rhett Broxel. So we'll see how he gets S rank in this mission. So right away you want an assault boost to the first objective point. The songbirds are great because they have a pretty generous explosion radius, so you can take out multiple enemies with one shot of them. And the Zimmermans are, as usual, really awesome for taking out minor enemies as well. So Rhett takes out a group of enemies there with the Songbirds, and here he's probably going to clear them out almost exclusively with um, Zimmermans. He does use the Songbirds a bit as well, just to while his uh, Zimmermans are reloading. However, to keep your ammo costs down, you want to use the Zimmermans more than the Songbirds here for the most part. Because the ammo cost of shotguns is much less than that of grenade launchers. With that said, there is some leniency in this mission for ammo costs. So that's the second group taken care of. Now Rhett's going to fly over to the third group while dodging all of these missiles with lots of quick boosts. And lastly, there is a fourth group down here. And that's it. That's all the Coyote forces taken care of. Alright, we'll take a look at the end mission screen so you can see the S rank criteria for yourself. So you want to spend about less than 4,000 in terms of repair costs, spend less than 13,000 or so for your ammo costs, and if you want to finish this mission in 2 or 3 minutes to get S rank. And that's about it. This one isn't too difficult, so you should be able to get S rank on this one if you optimize your strategy just as Rhett has. Thank you so much for watching. If this video helped you out, please consider liking and subscribing, it helps the channel out a whole lot. Until the next video. Happy hunting, fellow mercenaries.